Hello guys, welcome back to this channel. Hope everyone is fine. On that note, let's start this video. This is week 4 assignment of the course blockchain and its uh, applications. So guys, these are completely our probable solutions. If there are any changes that come to our notice, definitely we will update that in the comment section guys. So before final submission, once again, check the comment section if any updates available. And you can suggest your so solutions as well in the comment section. So we will try to discuss that. We tried our best to give you the most probable solutions. Let's see the first one guys. What is a fork in the context of Bitcoin? So for first question, option A is the probable solution guys. A change in the Bitcoin protocol that leads to the creation of a new version of the blockchain. So mark option A as the probable solution for first question. Guys, please subscribe our channel for the past five years. We have been providing solutions for various imperial courses, including blockchain as well. So guys, please subscribe our channel to get updates and click the bell icon as well. Similarly, and definitely like the video guys. Then only our videos will reach other students as well who are in need like you so that they will also get benefited like you guys and definitely share this with your friends and college, college friends in your WhatsApp unofficial student groups. Second one, which of the following statements are correct? So initially it receives 100, 100 bitcoins as a reward for successfully mining a block at time 2009 Jan. So for second question, I have got three probable solutions. Option B, option A and option C guys. So mark A, B and C as the probable solutions for second question. Now let's move on to the third question. Third one, how does the Bitcoin network prevent double spending? So for third question, option B is the probable solution guys. Relying on a proof of work consensus mechanism ensures that only one valid transaction is accepted, right? So mark option B as the probable solution for third question. Now let's move on to the fourth one. Which of the following is a challenge of the permissionless model in blockchain? So for fourth question also, option B is the probable solution guys. So mark option B as the probable solution for fourth question as well. Next, fifth one. Which of the following is not, not included in a block of a blockchain? So for fifth question, option d ip address of the miner so mark option d as the probable solution for fifth question next sixth one so before getting into the sixth question i want to make a small announcement guys so that is regarding exam preparation mcqs so for the course blockchain and its application we have collected exam preparation mcqs guys. so these are the past nptl assignment mcqs with five years of NPTEL experience, we are giving these guys. So here you are going to get a huge number of 300 MCQs guys. 300 MCQs in a Google Drive PDF restricted link. So 300 MCQs for one person, it is just 300 rupees only. If you take it along with your friends in a bulk for two to five person access, combinedly you can get it for 500 rupees only guys. You can share that 500 rupees among the group for two to five members, you can share that very less price among yourself so please share this news with your friends and classmates and ask them to join in your group and one one person from your group mail me to this email id guys bk179417 at the rate gmail.com so this is the mail id mail me to this email id if you're confirmed to make the payment guys already many students have taken our pack and got benefited guys so 300 mcqs for one person 300 for two to five persons combinedly 500 rupees guys so that's it guys and there is another membership as well. It is YouTube membership. So you have to join our channel. Here you will get 100 plus MCQs only guys, not 300. The price is also very less, 89 rupees only. It is only for one person and for one month. And it is only available in video format, not PDF like the 300 MCQs. So if you want this YouTube membership pack, no need to mail us. Ma uh, directly go to our YouTube channel page. So S Kumar Edu is our YouTube channel page. Beside the subscribe button, there is a join button, right? So click on this join button. Then a small window will open like this. 
Select the second one, videos only for members pack, that is 89 per month pack. And again, click on this blue color join, bu uh, join button and make payment directly to YouTube, not to me. That's it. You will become member of our channel and you can get access to all of our members only videos. Here you can see members only videos specially prepared for the only for members guys. So here you can see blockchain part 1, part 2 and part 1 also prepared. And you can get all these videos, all these videos for the same price guys, no extra charge needed. But my suggestion is if you are preparing in a final exam point of view, it's better to take this 300 MCQ pack because membership YouTube membership video pack is just a sample pack. In this 300 MCQ pack, you are get validity till the exam results day. So you can continue to have the access till the exam results day. But here the validity will only be one month. In 360, uh, 300 MCQ pack, for one person it is 300 guys. So you will get a lot of MCQs, 300 huge number of MCQs to get better preparation ahead of the final exam, right? It is easy to revise as well. So mail me to this email id bk179417 at gmail.com. I will give the same email id in the description as well guys. So please share this news with your friends and classmates and do form groups and purchase this pack. That's it guys. Now let's get back to the solutions. So sixth question, which of the following is not a failure? So for sixth question, option B, double spending is the probable solution guys. Next, seventh one. Seventh question. Which of the following best describes safety and liveness in Bitcoin? So for seventh question, option A is the probable solution. Next, eighth one. So eighth one, what is the main purpose of the proof of work mechanism in Bitcoin? So for 8th question, option D is the probable solution guys. So mark option D as the probable solution for 8th question. Next, ninth one. Ninth one. What is the correct order of events when adding a new block to the block Bitcoin blockchain? So for ninth question, option B is the probable solution guys. So mark option B as the probable solution for ninth question and moving on to the final question of the assignment that is tenth one which of the following statements is incorrect regarding proof of work in the context of folks attacks and the monopoly problem so for tenth and final question option d is the probable solution guys so friends, these are the probable solutions for week 4 assignment of blockchain and its application course. So hope this video helpful for you. If you feel the same, please subscribe our channel. Definitely like the video and please share this with your friends and classmates. And don't forget to purchase this 300, huge number of 300 MCQs Google Drive PDF pack guys. So that's it guys for this video. So keep supporting us like this. So until the next video, goodbye. Time.